What's up guys, Night of 2010 from WhoPro.com. I got a uh, coal review for you today. These are the Leonara coals. Uh, I picked these up from 5 um, as well as uh, hookaset.com. I have a box coming from them. Um, I picked these up from 5 Star because I ordered the Luxor coals and they were sold out. So after I placed my order, I got a phone call saying, you know, do you want to substitute anything in? And I said, yeah, you know, go ahead and put a Leonar in there. That's fine. So um, this is the box here. It's got the little Leo lion on there. You know, clever. Um, and then the O in Leo is a coconut. It tells you that they are coconut natural poles. Made from coconut husks, so they're totally natural, um, eco-friendly, yada, yada, yada. Now, inside the cardboard box is a little plastic bag keeping them safe in case the box gets wet which I think is cool now what you notice if you watched uh, monsters review on these uh, I think monster and submerged shelf both did a uh, review on these they noticed that the coals are all packed in there flat like this as opposed to upright and stone hinged in the box like they are with Coco Jammers. And that is true. Um, they are packed in there the same way. Or, I'm sorry, the other way. Um, which is, you know, it's different. Um, but not a big deal. Um, they look very similar to Coco Jammers. Um, the sides where they cut the blocks into little pieces are a little bit more porous and uh, looks like they're more prone to heat um, but the top and bottom is very solid um, they're pretty jagged um, for the most part they're all the same size but there's a few that are going to be broken or otherwise deformed and misshaped so it's a lot like Jamra's in that sense that they're different sizes and shapes and as they get to the bottom of the box they're probably going to be a little bit smaller and more broken up so, um, I'm going to throw these on the burner, load up a bowl, and then uh, I'll get back to you guys once I'll let you know how long they take to heat up and, and all that good stuff once I start smoking. Uh, so sit tight, I'll be right back. Alright guys, I got the uh, Leonara coals warmed up. Uh, they're, they're finished heating up and I've threw them on the bowl. Uh, I've got Nakla Mix Ice Line from, uh, or the flavor is Apple... Um, apple mint and um, yeah they took under five minutes to fully heat up which I thought was really cool it was really quick like uh, even with coco jamras or like coco nars or something like that they take you know probably seven eight minutes on average um, these were ready to go in about four minutes um, I flipped them kind of prematurely just because they were heating up so fast but um, and then once I flipped them, they finished heating on both sides. So it, it was a pretty decent warm-up time. Um, one thing that I do have to say was the smell while they were warming up. And I know normally you're going to get a smell with coals. They're not going to be odorless no matter what they say. There's going to be a smell. These ones are actually a really, really strong smell. Um, it's worse than Jamra's or Coconara or any of those kind of coals. Um, it's kind of weird, but I smelled, it smells like you're burning cheese. Like if you're making like a queso salsa dip or something like that, if you're, if you're baking that on a stove, that's what it smells like. I don't know why, but that's what I smelled. Um, I threw them on the burner and then walked back inside and a few minutes later I walked by the door and it smelled like I was burning like Velveeta cheese. Really weird. Um, but it was a very strong kind of bad smell I don't mind the smell as long as you light them outside you're gonna be fine but I just thought that was kind of weird so I wanted to mention that um, but anyway uh, took about five minutes to heat up threw them on the bowl and another five to ten minutes for them to finish warming up the bowl so that it would uh, it was getting nice clouds uh, they took a little bit longer these uh, from what I read and what other people have said in the reviews is that they don't burn as hot as coco jammers or coconaris so that is probably what the problem was with it taking so long to heat up the bowl so um, I've got my KM uh, single pair and a social smoke 
Pro Lounge House, um, three Leon R's and a wind cover on an Egyptian bowl. Uh, let's see what we got. Now, very, very big clouds, and it's Nakla, um, which I think is cool, because Nakla usually doesn't give huge clouds, but these are very nice. Um, I haven't tried this flavor before, so I'll probably have to smoke another flavor that I have had before so I know what it's supposed to taste like, but I think these coals are actually tainting the tobacco a little bit with the smell. Um, I mean, the taste. Uh, it, there's a little bit of a chemical taste to this tobacco, and it, it has a strong mint in it, so that could be why, but I, I, I'm almost positive that it's because of the coals, um, which is unfortunate, and uh, it's kind of disappointing, but I mean, they're a cheap coal, you know, they're eight bucks for 120 coals, so it's not going to be the best, but they are adding a little bit of a taint to the taste of the tobacco. But, I don't know, I mean, for how long they take to warm up, it's not bad. I've been out here for a little over a half hour, and they're not even at half the size, so they're going to last probably about an hour and 10 to an hour and 15 minutes. <coughs> Excuse me. I don't know why it just got all orange out here, but... <coughs> um, yeah, guys, that's what I'm picking up from these. Um, <coughs> excuse me. Like I said, they add that little bit of chemical to it. <coughs> kind of dried out my throat, but... Um, they're not bad. I mean, I'd give them like a 7 out of 10, maybe. They're decent for the price, so... You can pick them up from 5 Um That's where I got these from, so check them out. And, um, yeah, guys, that's it for now. I'll probably do a follow-up review on these like I did with the Gaia Coles once I play around with them a little bit more and see if I change my rating at all. So uh, keep an eye out for that. And, um, yeah, we'll talk to you soon. This is Night of 2010. And uh, take it easy, guys.